and Sara, welcome to this video series on Microsoft Excel. In the last video, I have shown you how to import a table uh, from an Oracle database to the spreadsheet. And in this video, I will be uh, telling you how to import multiple tables that is basically two tables from the database and join uh, both the tables and uh, display the record in the spreadsheet. So to import the tables you have to go to the data tab uh, select from other sources go to from Microsoft query uh, then you will uh, get the this uh, option to select from which source you want to import the data so you have to first create your data source uh, I will tell you how to create in next video so just select the data source click on ok it will connect to the data source and then it will ask for a password click on ok uh, and it will stabilize your connection with the database so you can then import your tables here so like this you will get the options here the following tables in your database are there you just select which table you want to import like I have to import employees and department Book two tables I have to import so I will select employees I will click this arrow it will load then I will select department table uh, yeah yeah departments table I will again click on this arrow and I will click next and then click OK. So here we will get to the Microsoft query wizard. As you can see, we have both two tables displayed here, employees and department. Okay. Now we have to make the join between these two tables. Uh, the employees table has a department ID and department table also have a department ID. So we just drag this. A column to this column so it will join these both the tables after that we will click here return data to our spreadsheet so it will give an option again like to import a table as a pivot table or as a pivot chart so we'll just click as a table we will click ok so it will import both the records from employees and department table and make the join on the department ID so here so you uh, it's a very good method to import multiple tables depending upon a common field value okay so hope you like this video uh, thank you and uh, please subscribe and please like if you like this video thank you